death of a self. Iconic play about achieving the classic American dream, but it has been revived in a way like never before, casting the main characters with black actors. After premiering on London's West End, it has made its way here to New York, to Broadway, and we are, is honored even the right word? <laughs> We are beyond thrilled to have one of the stars of the show, the absolute legend, the Emmy, Grammy, Tony Award winning Andre the Shields is in the... Did, did I even get close to doing the right service in introing you? How are you, brother? I'm very well. Happy to be with you and the doctor. Uh, it is good to have you in the building here. And we talk about cast with black actors. This is not the death uh, uh, of a black salesman here is what we're talking about. This is the death of a salesman who happens to be black. What's the difference in those two the things? Dif there? The difference is this. Mm -hmm. When Henry, uh, when Arthur Miller, there also is a Henry Miller, but we're not talking about him. <laughs> when Arthur Miller wrote Death of a Salesman in 1949, he was concentrating on white male hypernormativity, right? It was the exclusive domain of white actors and white audiences. He was still telling his truth about the accessibility of the American dream. However, this is 2021. We are late in the pandemic. If you want to know the truth about the American dream, you must ask the question of that demographic of society that has been traditionally marginalized to its edges. And that's black America. Mm -hmm. Because now we are seeing it through a glass darkly. Mm -hmm. What adjustments had to be made? That, that, the, even the smallest of things, even where, where, the, uh, where the young man wants to go to college, even little things like that are, are, are different and you have to adjust. We're, we're still talking about the question mm. in a country where everything is for sale who can own the american dream now there is an arthur miller estate mm. who has to pass judgment okay. on everything that we do in the play mm -hmm. it's the power of the written word when spoken. So we have changed nothing mm. Mm. except the lens through which you experience the tragedy of Willie Loman. Mm. We introduced you talking about the, um, right, the, uh, the Emmy, the, uh, the, the, the Tony, the Grammy. Tony, the Grammy. The, no Oscar. It was a funny line you had for it. You said, I'll, I'll, I'll not let you plan to win an Oscar. You just, you'll take whatever statue that has your, your name on it. Right, but exactly. you also <laughs> talk one of your virtues <laughs> is that when you get to the top of the mountain, right. you realize you're at the bottom of the next and keep climbing. Yeah. Are, are you still climbing? Oh, Where absolutely. Are you climbing? Where are you As a matter tonight? of fact, that's how I got this gig mm. in Death of a Salesman. I'd done my final performance in Hadestown. This is not a cause and effect explanation. I wanted to finish Hades Town so I could go home and wash the dishes that were overflowing in my sink. <laughs> you know, get rid of the ring around the bathtub. <laughs> Respond, pay some bills and that kind of thing. <laughs> and my phone rings and I answer, hello, this is Andre. And it's Wendell Pierce yeah. calling me from Budapest. Wow. And he says, Mr. DeShields. I wonder if you would play my older brother, Ben, wow. because Death of a Salesman is coming to Broadway. Wow. I said, Wendell, let me think about it. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> really? Oh, That call right there? Wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. Because as you have so lovingly prepared the lead up to this, when the blessing with your name on it arrives, you don't hesitate. You say, thank you. Mm. We have two back to back Faith Friday guests today. That's that's we we've been taken to church twice. Is that what today. this is? Faith Friday. <laughs> that was supposed to be Cece. She did the previous segment, but you just took us to church again. We we have been buzzing around this building today, and a lot of folks didn't realize you were on the rundown. People were so excited to know you were going to be in this building. Oh, today. how kind of you! Um, it is an absolute pleasure to have you here, and we we hope you'll come back. Oh, absolutely. We hope All I need back. is the invitation. Thank well, you so much. It, it stands. And, folks, you can catch Death of a Salesman, Hudson Theater, on Broadway, limited engagement now through January 15th. You said it's been going well. Congrats on everything. 
Thank you. I'm going to have to ask Wendell about that story. You said he didn't have to convince you. Yes on the spot, huh? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.